Michael Caine may have been in London promoting his new film, Cars 2, but it was Batman we all wanted to know about. So what juicy goss could he give us? I can't tell you. You get shot. On Batman, you get shot if you speak about it. I'm just going to tell you, it'll be the best one. Undeterred, we didn't let that stop us. He goes round two. Is there anything juicy you can tell us about what's coming no, up? No, you, 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 if I, you, you sign, when you do Batman, you sign like an official secrets act, a legal document that you won't speak about it. Chris Nolan is the most secretive guy. First time he came to me for Batman, he came to my house in the country. He lived near me in Surrey. And he came on a Sunday morning and we opened the door and there's Chris Nolan standing there and he had a script. He said, this is called Batman Begins. You want to play the butler? I cut this short because I'm supposed to be advertising cars. He said, you want to play the butler? And he stayed while I read it and took the script away. He wouldn't even trust me with the script, so he certainly wouldn't trust me with information. But it'll be out next year and it'll be the best one ever. It'll be as, almost as good as Cars 2. <laughs> we bet Chris Nolan will love that.